Hello YouTubers, diecast collectors. Today I have a series of just some C10 trucks, 1971 or 1972. So this one here, I've got, it's by Greenlight. All of these are going to be by Greenlight trucks. Some you've already seen before. And this one here is a new one. Uh, it's a Sanford and Son Hollywood series. Very cool in color. So uh, let's get this out. So Green Light does a very good job of uh, details. You got painted headlights, turn signal indicators, no mirrors, that's fine. None of these trucks I don't think I have have mirrors, but that's okay. Do exhaust painted tail lights. So let's. Uh, so I have a few here on my table that uh, we'll look at. Let me uh, get the turntable so we can look at these a little bit better without my hand being in the way. So if you're a night collector of trucks, you might want to get a couple of these. Um, very nicely done. Look at the wheel, look at the hubcaps and stuff. All very good detail. 164 scale. I love these trucks. So that was this one. This next one here is a green machine. Uh, if you've seen my previous videos, it's appeared on just uh, the green machine. Love it. So, this one here is, I really like the color. I'm not a real blue person, but this one here is really nice. All the lines are correctly on it everything kind of lines up the bed lines up great detail now the hoods do open on these um, some of them I just can't get open so I just don't try so this one here if you look look at this the mud splatter on the back you got the ladder which is awesome. Especially if you have a diorama you can put on there. But the back detail that look like mud splatter on the back. Got the steely wheels on there. Just a good old truck to fall in love with. If you're in the trucks. So you can see the front end. They've changed to different years. Not too much change in the back for as a bed wise. Mainly the front. That was pretty typical of Chevy and Ford April. Change something a little different. And then uh, my old farm truck, I love it. The rusty look. Again with the wheels or steely wheels with the hubcaps, painted door handles, windshield wipers, up a couple of bales of straw on the back. So this one here are pretty similar trucks. The front end. Same. I really like the red one. Red is really cool. 
they say the window with the chrome around the window makes the window look bigger I think and then um, of course we have a four-wheel drive got the Chevy and the uh, Golf logo and then they do have campers which are really cool too awesome With the, uh, you know, it's the hubcaps and everything, steal your wheels on there. And then, I have an older one right there. Got like a little antenna on the top. Very detailed with the vents and stuff like that. So if you, you can tell the it's like a TV TV antenna. The little details on the the, the little lights on the side of the camper really makes the the model really makes them look good. That's what I like about green light. Like they really do a good job on the detail there. So this was this uh, Chevy trucks here. Uh, the main one was this one was new, but the, all the rest of these are all pretty cool trucks to have. I don't know which one would be your best if you're a Chevy guy. So I'm not sure if that's all of my green light ones, but that's all the ones I pulled off the shelf or the table. For this video so all right guys stay safe out there and um, collect these things these things here are really cool green light um, does a really good job on uh, on our detail so it's got Chevy right across the hood I know just now notice that that one doesn't have it but that one does so, uh, all right, guys. Thanks for watching, and uh, stay safe. We'll see you on the next video. See you. Bye.